A couple in Grand Rapids is getting another chance to say I do after Ian ruined plans for their big day. A new venue in Kentwood is stepping up and helped organize the wedding here in West Michigan. News Ace Kyle Mitchell joins us now with the couple's story. All new tonight at 6. Kyle. Soon, Brian, the couple had planned to travel to Jacksonville, Florida for a wedding Saturday, but Hurricane Ian meant that event was off. A week that started with difficult news. We decided to just scrap the whole thing. So Monday was a very bad day, <laughs> to say the least. Is ending in relief for bride Lauren Scott and groom Kinsley Amlalo. We were going to have a ceremony on the beach and a small reception at a private room in a restaurant also on the beach. The couple from Grand Rapids had a destination wedding with 40 guests planned for Jacksonville, Florida. But Hurricane Ian had other plans. I was devastated because I knew like there's no way we can ask our guests now to try to travel into a hurricane. We can't travel into a hurricane. So the only logical thing to do at that point was to cancel it. So are you the Florida venue was only available next Friday, but most of the guests couldn't make it. The bride and groom started reaching out to venues in Grand Rapids and didn't give up. We could have sat back and just waited till the next week and went with three people. Morena's, a new event space in Kentwood, responded with a call from the owner. So I started telling her the story about what happened, and she's like, okay, I definitely, you know, have to try to help you now. The space is still planning to have a ribbon cutting on Sunday, but decided Saturday's grand opening had to be rescheduled. It is really rare to get everything together within a matter of a couple of days. While wedding plans are often made more than a year in advance, Marina's owner found vendors to make it possible in less than two days. We like 36 hours flat. She had everything, like the caterer, the food, the bartender, like everything. So it, it's been amazing. With the event now closer to home, more of the bride and groom's friends and family will be able to join them. They're beyond grateful for the community support. It means to me that there are still good people out there that are willing to cancel all of their plans, you know, just to help you out. So that means a lot. Morena's is still working on rescheduling the grand opening celebration that was planned for Saturday. Brian Sue.